What's up guys, I'm Destiny for Nox Gaming and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be making a chain blitz build for beginners. And before I start, I would like to thank you all for your advices in my previous videos. I really appreciate it. And don't worry, I'm gonna listen to what y'all say. Thank you for the advices. I hope you can keep giving me advices. Alright. And here's a build. It's without tapestry. As you can see, I'm not even using the lacerating attacks. All I did was just spinning the blades. And it's dead. Yep, as. As you can see, this build is pretty good without lacerating attacks, which means without savage three. Let's just check out the build real quick. So here's the build. Easy to build, easy to farm. And I'm using Knockout King and Overpower. Tenacious and tough as always. And here's Adrenaline. So I'm gonna use that Spinning Blades a lot. So my stamina is gonna get decreased a lot. And it's gonna give me bonus damage for every 10 stamina missing, which means I can get around 33 extra damage when my stamina hits zero. And here are just two random stuff I got. Zeal is pretty good. If you can get it to plus six, maybe you can change this one into something else or this one into something else. And here's uh, here I'm using Tempest. If you don't have Tempest, you can always change to Iceborne or none at all. And here's the weapon. It's Reaper's Dance and Hurricane Blades. I don't know which mod actually is the best, but I'd rather use this one. Momentum Blades is a good choice, but it's from Lady Luck, so I'm not gonna use it. Serratic Blades is good too, but I'm not using any wounding type of thing, so I'm not gonna equip it, which means Hurricane Blades is the only choice. Let's try it out on another Behemoth. I think I want to try it out on that Cool shot right there. I almost fell down. So st stamina management is something that is very important in this game currently. But with Shame Blades, I don't think you really need that. Because the lower your stamina are, the higher damage are, there, right? Okay. Easy. Ouch. Okay. I'm trapped here. I'm trapped here. Hello. Okay, never mind. I'm not. Okay. As you can see, this build is pretty good. Without wounding, because that's one thing that I hate from laser writing attacks. It's because it hits so slow, although it gives very high damage, but it hits too slow. Too damn slow. Even if I brought Catalyst with me. That's why I'm not using it. I'm not even using any laser rating attacks. Let's try it on this behemoth right here. It's strike. Okay, let me tr see. Oh, okay, it's not gonna fly. Okay. Okay, time to spin.
Okay. Ouch. The reason why I say Iceborne is actually a good choice too is because I brought Tenacious with me. So once your HP drops, your damage also drops. That's where Iceborne comes in. You get bonus life still for a minute. There we go. Yep, this build is pretty good without those laser rating attacks. And one thing that you need to know right here is every time you use these spinning combos, you're going to continue to the third phase of the attack, which means you can spam another spinning attack. So it's one, two, three, spin, left click, the next one, and then you can spin again. And it keeps on going as long as you have stamina. All right. So I'm going to do a little damage showcase right here. So let's check it out on this panga right here. Okay. It's doing its raking attack. That was close. There we go. Head. There we go. Kaboom. Another leg. Should be a stagger. I mean, yep. Heartbreak. Should be that before I cast my active skill. Oh no. Okay. Let's kill it then. Boom. I missed. Oh my god. There we go. It should be an epic ending, but I missed. But never mind. As you can see, this build is pretty good. Try it out. It's easy to build. You can get the materials. <clears throat> and it's not disciplined. So you can get Tempest from crafting. If you don't have, as always, you can always bring Asborn. Remember, and if you can, and if you have enough rums for it, you can go for Catalyst build. And that's all for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It's free, and you can always unsubscribe. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.